What's going on guys? It's your boy Chance and we're back with another banger. You know what I'm saying? We got Tyler sir and titus you know what i'm saying we're gonna go look at some animals today so that titus can get a little bit of an idea on what kind of animal he wants to get and tyler you know what i'm saying i made him drive because why not woke up every day saying life is a bitch you did die broke or get busy getting rich niggas did me dirty left me dead in the ditch learned to forget but i never did forget lord to the team i ain't never gonna switch he was at the party getting drunk getting lit in the back of my head i'm like fuck that shit i was busy in the lab making songs making hits Trying to get money to cash out Like you take your arm if you're looking for a handout I've been on the move for a long time Fighting with the man on my shoulder I was dealing with self-doubt uh, All my life I've been the fucking underdog the Used to wonder how these niggas got it all I was getting one play a day Now I got a couple thousand on my catalog yeah. See through your niggas know ultrasound. ultrasound School of motherfuckers you a class, class, clown. class clown You was talking shit where you at now hey. Everybody play the tough guy to us man down uh, Dancing with the devil Lucy always in the function You don't really have an option See more tears than the onion I was following with my fashion Probably die for the shit Probably come and get the bus Losing my patience I waited my turn Can't collect everything that I earn Built a few bridges But some gotta burn They keep talking down Like boy when you gonna learn Been on the come up for some time now People like a trust is hard to find now Swear to God there's so much on my mind now Coming for the word up it's mine now You don't wanna whip me on a bad day Gonna take off on the wrong way Always on my job Working hard Treat every single day Gunning for the top, will I make it there? Rapping with the legends in the top tier. I've been on the edge, I got no fear. Please don't you do me no favors, no trust for these niggas that put it together. They planning to take it apart. All right, guys, we have pulled up. Damn, shut your bitch ass car up. Anyways, we pulled up to PetSmart. Got classical music bumping in the background like it's 1974. But we came to look at some animals, you know what I'm saying? Oh, it looks so sad. Doing? Hey, mamas. Did you hear me oh, I think I just fell in love. Is that a black extra large bean? <laughs> I'd buy you in a heartbeat if I had the money. Wow, that's a beautiful dog, my boy. What's up, baby? What's up, baby? How you doing, baby? How's you doing, baby? Softy. Hey, little baby. Hey, little baby. <laughs> Look at that little baby. All right, guys, I'm going back to my routes and I'm pulling up to the fish section. First section I come to when I come to PetSmart is the fish section. Even though I sold my tanks, I will get back into it. I promise you that. Some koi fish. Never put these in fish tanks. I don't care what nobody says. I don't care how big it is. Never put koi in fish tanks. Oh, that's it. That'd be a beauty if it grew up. It's a white koi. And of course, you know my routes. African cichlids. The best fish ever made. Right here. The thing about these blood parrots is when they're stressed, they got black on them for some reason. I noticed that with when I got my parrots, when they finally got comfortable, all the black went away and they were just a bright orange color. Never really seen black stay on that, you know, blood parrots, but when they are stressed or anything like that, it shows up for some reason. And of course you got your severums. They grow up to be the most beautiful fish, but they take a long time to grow. But they are the most beautiful fish when they're full grown because they get all their coloring and they get a lot of different patterns on them. As you know, they get older some neon tetras i hate neon tetras personally because just look at them bro like these are like one of the worst fish on earth but you still gotta love them if you're a fish guy so of course i still love them but i hate them at the same time <laughs> one of my favorites was an akara cichlid when they get the older they get way more vibrant they get a you know a just straight up electric blue as you can see right here it's just straight vibrant all right guys we're gonna head over and we're gonna see if they have any king snakes because eventually I do want to get a king snake. It is my my dream snake is king snake. It looks like they don't have any king snakes, sadly, and they are out of a lot of things. But of course they got the beardies. <laughs> look at this! Look at this little thing. Bro's not even phased. What up with it? <laughs> but yeah, beardies, bearded dragons, and leopard geckos are probably the most you know, known lizards to keep. 
Ooh, they got a scorpion. Speaking of scorpion, I do want to get one of those soon. Down here, they usually have like a tortoise or something, but they do not. This is one of my dream lizards right here. Look at that thing. This is one of my dream lizards. I am going to get this one day. A blue tongue skink. They get humongous, dog. Like this big? Yeah, look at them. Look at them as it is right now. Oh my goodness. That is one of my. And this, this tongue is straight blue. And right here, my favorite angelfish, which are black angelfish. I don't know. They just have like a, a cool, like, you know, their, their demeanor is just so cool. Because, like, look at that. It's fully blacked out. And, you know, different types of angelfish. I had I had some of these white ones and yellow ones and some of the black ones. But I really like the black ones a lot more. And right here, we got the clown loaches. These motherfuckers get, like, from right here to right here. I'm pretty sure they get, like, 12 inches long. So don't look at this fish. Buy it and just put it in a fish tank because this thing does get humongous. Okay. Um, you know, they take a long, long time to grow, but they will get about 12 inches. All right, guys, leaving PetSmart. How was it for you, sir? Pretty good. Some cute dogs. Did you see anything like that's like, wow, I want to get that? Uh, honestly, I really like that husky we were talking about. If I had the money and stuff like that, I would definitely adopt a husky. Like that husky right there? Yeah. But did you see anything that was like, wow, I need to get that? Uh, just that one that was by the door. It was like that smaller dog. It reminded me of Lady of the Tramp. All right, guys, I guess we are going to the Humane Society. Well, you call it the pound, I call it the Humane Society. It's the same thing. Anyway, guys, up at the Humane Society, we're going to see the kittens, the dogs, all that good stuff. And hopefully they have some bunnies, you know what I'm saying? Let me tell you right now. If I see a black baby kitten and a ginger baby kitten, I might have to come back, dude. Both of them? Just one or the other, dude. Both of them? Double <laughs> down, double down. Double down? Yeah. Double down on double that down. thing. I found little baby banners. <laughs> bro, look. Hold on. She was cute, bro. <laughs> oh, oh, dude. Look at that it's baby. It's abandoned, too. They found it on the side of the road. Hey, little baby. Oh, look at that little cute. Hey, little baby. Oh, these ones right here. That suits you, Titus. I wanted the bag. These definitely suit me. Oh. Hey, Tyler, bro. Look at that little baby. Oh, my goodness. Oh, oh, oh. Dude, this is a bad idea. Look at all these beautiful babies. Look at that little beautiful thing. You little cutie, man. Wait, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's get a thumbnail. No, you gotta, you gotta be on this side. No, you gotta be like this. Over here. You gotta be like. You gotta be like. Come on, look at the camera. Look at the camera? Yeah, look at the camera. Perfect. Look at this little baby. Oh. Aww. 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 look at that little baby. It's a pit bull. It's a pit bull? Yeah. Look at this little. Oh my god, is that Chico? <laughs> is that Chico? Oh, there's, there's a black one, Titus. Oh, Look at that. That gray one's beautiful, but. Oh. <laughs> oh my goodness. A cat for the camper, bro. Oh, it's a little baby. Oh my gosh, dude. I did say if I saw a black one, I would get it. There's your black cat, Titus. Hold on. It's my brother. It looks just like you. 
Oh, look at this little baby. Hey, little baby. Oh, it's a little baby. Put up on the O-line, dude. <laughs> Put up on the O-line. That's a big boy. That's a boxer mix. Tips on training because I never trained a dog before. All right, Titus, what are you fucking Walking doing? What are you doing today? I'm getting both of them. You're getting both of them? Both can. brothers. Jaden Titus. Jaden right. Titus, right there. Dang, bro. This is going to be a fucking banger for dude. Bro. This thing is going to be a banger, dog. That, I've never actually had dogs by myself, so this is going to be an interesting ride. For Don't sure. worry, I'll help you. Thank you. And I'm having Beanie spend the night tonight, so she's going to be like, what the fuck are these things? <laughs> That's gonna be cool interaction. Bro, double down. Getting both of them for the YouTube house. First animals to come home with us. But, like, you couldn't separate them, bro. Because, like, changed the whole demeanor once we brought the other one in. So, like, you know, brothers, they gotta stay together. Well, we had to go with one. For whatever reason. Who cares? Whatever. Cool. Anyways, little Chico came home. His brother is back at the pound. Oh, well, what, what do you think of your your your, your choice of buy? Uh, I'm really excited. I love small dogs like this, especially if it being a Chihuahua. It won't like completely destroy the house, but you know, I'll, I'll fix the damages. It's not going to do anything to the house. Yeah, that's what you're basically saying. Yeah, <laughs> but it's a cute little thing. But this is going to be a learning experience because I've never like had a puppy. And hey, little buddy. So Titus is leaving, so I'm going to look over your little Chico here for a little bit. Uh, but me and Tyler are going to leave, go get some street tacos at his grandpa's butt. For right now, I'm just going to watch him. But yeah, it's a cute little thing. Sadly, we couldn't get both of them in, but maybe we'll talk him into it. All right, so we pulled back to the Humane Society, okay, because they said... Well, whoever, I, I don't know who, you know, said only have one. Well, we're getting the second one. Who cares? We're doing it anyways. Tyler, it was Tyler's idea, so anything it's happens, it's on him. So he's filling out a form so that we can get this little man. Um, this was all his idea. I was just like, I mean, if you're doing it, you're doing it, man. But we're back here. Sad ending, we didn't get the dog. What a ride. What a ride. Man. I tried my best. Why can't, why can't he just be like, yep, that's fine. That's it. Oh, man. All right, guys. So we got one puppy today. Try to go get the other one so, you know, the brothers be together. It didn't work out. Oh, well. I'm kind of sad. I wanted a good ending, but, you know, at least what it is. You know, at least I got, you know, the sad ending, horrible ending, you know, that clickbait. Yes. It's been your boy Chance. Like, comment, subscribe, and we out. Peace.